I'm so pleased with that so many of these red tulips have come up. They're not in full bloom yet. They're going to be coming blooming in the next few days. But all of these tulips I planted in pots and then I fed them and planted them out here in this bed. Because if I plant tulips in the flower beds in the autumn, the squirrels know where I've planted the bulbs and dig them up and eat them. Whereas if I plant the tulips in the spring, after they've flowered, then the squirrels will have forgotten where they are. Yes. You're not eating enough squirrels, I've met. Bear, you're not catching enough squirrels. Pepper, you're too old to catch squirrels anymore. Even though you caught a rat the other day, you're so good. So I'm very pleased with uh, the number of tulips that are in this bed. That would be about four years of, or five years of pots. Uh, that have been planted out, that I had tulips of pots. Now I have to intersperse them with grape hyacinths or something. But I'm very pleased with how that's going to turn out. It's going to look spectacular in the next day or so. And then I love these little tulips. These ones I've planted out. I haven't planted any more for a few years. So I'm just hoping you're going to mess up my tulips, oh, Inca. Up my tulips. Look, honestly, can't take dogs anywhere. But these are a fantastic tiny tulip. I'd love to plant more of them uh, some year. Anyway, those are my tulips, or they will be, as long as they don't get demolished by dogs. So it's kind of exciting that this year that it really is going to be a good bed of tulips after years of slowly potting them up and planting, feeding them and then planting them on. So that'll be a good bed. Now, should we go inside and have dog supper or dogs have supper? This used to have loads of grape hyacinths all along here. Now there's only those few. I'll have to plant them in again or something. Never eat.